Welcome to this video tutorial for AutoCAD printing in AutoCAD 2012. In this video, we're going to show you how to print an A1 drawing. Now, we already have a drawing producing a model, as you can see here. This drawing is set to an A1 or produced to fit to an A1 sheet. So, first off, we'll go to File and Page Setup Manager and you modify the current page this up. Now this is an A4, A4 printer we won't be using that as it's a large format sheet. Now here you have a list of all the printers attached to your network or to your system. Currently we don't have a large format printer attached to this system so we're going to use a standard PDF which works as a printer and now we need to pick the A1. Now here you'll see these loads of different sizes um, you, you may get this with your large format printer also but I'd always advise to go for ISO and then the page size you don't want the full bleed so if you scroll down you'll see it now look there you have the ISO A0 and ISO A1 these are part that, that this one here this one's portrait and this one's landscape so it's a landscape print so you'll select this now you have extents. Extents is this hidden line around the extents of the page. Window. A window can created be created um, through a um, a point from one end of a drawing sheet to another. Currently, we don't have a drawing sheet attached, but that's what you'd use your window for. The layout is just the full extent of the page itself. For this point, we'll use it as an extent center plot so it centers the print on the plot on the uh, on the page sorry and then here you have your different plot styles you might have your own plot styles plot styles define the pen whips at which your machine uh, prints your uh, your different uh, layers uh, at different thicknesses we'll just have the autocad standard one at this point one to one and that will be set and I'll show you why we have this set one to one shortly so you say okay to that close. Now we'll create a viewport. As you can see we have a viewport layer. This viewport layer is uh, being set not to print which is usually the case for viewport layers because this will be within a drawing sheet. So you go view, viewports and now this will be within a sheet if we had one in this case. And there's your viewport and there you can see the model now what we need to do is we need to zoom this to scale because we're going to be printing at one to one. So you double click your viewport. Z for zoom. And as you can see you have your command line down here. So we want to, this drawing is, is drawn at one to two hundred. So it's one to two hundred XP. And there, that, that drawing there, the model has been zoomed one to one on this page. You double click out of your viewport and now you see this is within the extent so now you go to plot and you can see here now we don't have fit to page checked because this would would, would, would affect the scale of the drawing itself so this needs to be set to one to one always so it's, it's set to scale and it's set to extent and to center plot so you preview And as you can see, your drawing is is set there, central central to the page, and you know scale to fit to an A1 page. And you press Escape. If there was a case that you yeah, wanted to do a window, if you had a, a drawing sheet attached, you would go Window. And now we can pretend the the the, the edge of the viewport is the extent of the drawing sheet. So usually you would have a point from one end of the sheet to the other. So we'll say you select this point and this point and this is still at one to one center plot and as you can see in this small preview the full extent of the model is on the page preview as you see there you have the same A1 print press escape and OK to plot 